what's up guys and welcome back to my channel happy new year uh i saw this video circulating on youtube after the holidays and i don't recall seeing it previous years but because i'm getting started in my youtube channel i thought that it would be super cool for me to just join in on the fun with this one um it's gonna be called what i got for christmas hubby edition let's get right into the video so the first thing was something you want and the something i want was a spa finder spa gift card i don't know if you guys can see that the last year i've been really big on skincare since moving to texas um i have really oily skin and so i um just kept on saying in this last six months i need a facial i need a facial i need to start getting facials i need to start treating myself to facials 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 so the something I wanted was my Spa Finder gift card for a facial. So on to the next gift. Something you need. So something I needed was a mouse. Um, since moving to Texas, I do um, obviously sit in front of a computer all day with work. And my mouse that my husband bought me about three, two to th three years ago, broke so my something i needed was a mouse so he bought me a mouse which in my, which was in my favorite color purple and i was really excited about this because even though this is like seven dollars it was seven dollars your girl did not want to pay so my something i want something i need so on to something to wear so for something to wear this is another thing in the last three months maybe I have been ramping and raving about uh, probably complaining that I really wanted a robe um, I've been working on staying in the house more something that I don't normally do but I've been working on staying in the house more and I just felt that I needed a robe when I'm walking around cleaning up on Sunday mornings Saturday mornings when I just want to lounge around I really wanted a robe so my something to wear was this Gilly mm, Gilligan and O'Malley robe burgundy robe I really like burgundy on my skin tone and it's it looks like corduroy material but I am in love with my robe I've been wearing it ever since I got it and um, yeah I was really excited along with my robe on something to wear I also got these cute comfy slipper socks that I've also been wearing down and it's crazy because in my last fat fit fun box if you guys watched the video in the last fat fit fun box I got some knee high socks that were super comfortable that I wore with a cute dress um, I think I inserted that picture as well that I wore with a cute dress so when I saw these I was like oh yes a slipper version of it super cute super excited and I wore these together on Christmas Day right after I opened <laughs> the box <laughs> now for the something to read so for my something to read um I, I my husband really took his time I feel like to pick this book out um, this book is called Grace Not Perfection. When I opened it up, I am, when not when I opened it up, when I opened the box, I immediately, immediately, immediately read the title and knew exactly what it was about. We have constant conversation about how I want to live this life where my kitchen looks like Pinterest, my laundry room looks like Pinterest board that I just follow, and my husband is like, you have you are very cheap with expensive taste you cannot get that but you don't realize how much social media takes a toll on your mind and on you in general so um, when i when i saw the title of this book i was like oh look at him gave him a look like this is really cute i really appreciate it i cannot wait to read it so this was my something to read um, but I've already started reading this book and the first chapter alone is amazing like they talk about the social media stigma <clears throat> and that we all live up to social media standards 
and that we want to live up to social media standards so much that we forget our own standards, which in turn makes us forget about ourselves. Ever since I read that first chapter, I've been telling all of my friends about it. And I cannot wait to dive into the second chapter. Life has just been so busy after the holidays between cleaning up and um, getting ready for work today. And yes, just so much. So um, I can't wait to read the second chapter of this book. Um, but yeah, so this was my something to read. There you have it, guys. His cute little Christmas thing. Something you want, something you need, something to wear, something to read was a success i love the idea so yes that is what i got for christmas that is the theme that my husband used i hope you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to subscribe to my channel um and i will give you guys more content thank you for tuning in again and happy holidays